Welcome back, this is the Amateur Jack. Today we got Gunslinger, Pallet Town, Suicidal. It's the last video I have to record this week. It's always a uh, a nice feeling being on the final video for the week. It's like, uh, I don't know, because cause there's, there's, there's two feelings that come with it, you know? There's there's the first feeling, which is like, oh, after this I get to, to relax, I get to be uh, done with talking for, like, the weekends. Uh, and then there is the uh, the other part of the feeling, which is like, it's the last video I'm recording for the week. I'm tired. <laughs> and, uh, kind of always happens to me at the end of the week where I'm like, final video. Don't have to do anything more after this. And I'm just like, man. Like, it's going to be so cool being able to, uh, to relax but then I'm like so tired that I can barely even appreciate it and I finish I'm just like man I wish I could go to bed and then there's the, the bittersweetness of having to set up all the titles and descriptions and thumbnails for it all afterwards and I'm like <laughs> so it's uh yeah I mean you know yeah yeah but uh it is uh it is a nice feeling having the last video being done, so, you know, about 20 more minutes here until I'm done with talking for pretty much the weekend. I, I don't really talk on the weekends ever. I'm uh, selectively mute, as I've discussed. Selective mutism. There's a whole subreddit for it, and, and we peeps are uh, special. Um... I don't really talk. I mean, I talk on uh, the YouTube videos, talk on the stream. I don't really talk outside of it so much. Even when I'm able to, I just, I don't know. I just, uh, I prefer not to. Talk, I don't know. I, I make a whole thing out of uh, being, like, in love with all of this, and then uh, I don't even like talking. <laughs> but, like I tell you, if I could get by without talking, it would be a dream. If I could, like, stream without talking and just, like, type to people, that would be, like, so much better. Not that I don't like what I do already, but like being able to, to do that instead would be so much more enjoyable. So much more relaxing. Because talking is in itself uh, a very tiring activity for me. Um, which is why I always say that uh, this is a very like physically taxing job. It's, it's, it's largely due to me not being able to, to talk or be able to handle talking so much because it's, it's already... You know, if I have to talk for like an hour, I'm already kind of like worn out. And then I, I do like seven hours of it every day. And it's like, mm, you know, but regardless, it's, um, I can operate when I'm tired. I can still have a conversation, talk and commentate and do everything I need to. I have uh, dust on my glasses. Let's get that out of there. Mm, slightly better, slightly better. Dude, he's did like 20 damage to us, like nothing. Back in the game. Stupid jerk. Still got the Pokemon stuff coming. I mean, I, it's, it's again, it's gonna come when I want it to, which is not today, but uh, another day. It'll happen eventually. I, I don't know when. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna make any promises. It's there. I got the plans for it. I got uh, ideas, concepts. You know, it's all there. I just have to, to make it happen, but it's it's it's, uh, it's it's a ways away. I'm gonna be getting a new um, profile picture like commission pretty soon as well, which is gonna be good fun, right? Um, lots of stuff to kind of uh, see coming up in the future. I'm excited about it, but we gotta get there first. It's coming up towards the end of the month. I get paid. It's always nice. Got to budget a little bit this month. I've been kind of in debt. Uh, for a while, so I want to make sure I'm budgeting this month to get out of debt, which will be very nice. I'm not like, uh, you know, dying here. Like, I'm okay. Um, I've just, it's been, it's been a little bit of a irresponsible, well, not really irresponsible, but like I bought my fridge and I bought a knife and I bought all this stuff and it's kind of got me, uh, in the negatives a little bit here. You know, towards the, uh, towards the beginning of the month, I'm, like, evened out, and then, like, as the month drags on, and I have bills and all this stuff coming out, I have to, uh, lose money again, and then I end up paying on interest on this stuff, and it's just cost me even more money, so if I, uh, 
if I budget for this month and then next month, I, I should be able to get uh, or for this coming month and then the following month, rather. So next month and the following. Um, if, I, if I budget properly and, and kind of get things going smoothly here, I should be able to get uh, out of debt and, and be back to, to nice even, you know, building up a savings kind of situation, which I'm not in right now, which I'd like to be. But I don't have a job. I mean, it's a little bit tricky, right? It's a little bit tricky to be uh, living here and, and trying to be as independent as I can be uh, without having a job. It's 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 doable. Don't get me wrong. It's very 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 doable. I just have to I have to make some more responsible decisions going forward. Not like much more responsible, but definitely more responsible. Uh, sure, let's get the uh, the Glock as well. Um, and then it'll be fine, right? It's not, uh, it's not the end of the world, it's just, uh, you know, a part of the world, so. But a little bit of, a uh, little bit of budgeting this month, uh, this coming month, and then, uh, the following, you know, and, and all will be right in the world again, and I'll be good. I don't like, uh, this situation, because it means I, I'm not really able to, like, buy games and stuff that I want to, because it wouldn't be a responsible decision. Um... So like the Amberjack tries is a little bit trickier because there are a few games that I want to try out that I'd have to buy, and um, it's just a little bit tricky, honestly. But you know, whatever, right? Like, it's fine. Look, it'll uh, it'll happen eventually. So it'll happen eventually because I'm gonna make it happen. You know, I'm gonna make sure that I am budgeting and, and getting things back on track here and. Making everything work out, but uh, it's got to be done. Like I said, last episode, a little tired, but you know, it is also last episode, so I'm also excited and uh, looking forward to the uh, the sweet, sweet release of uh, no longer having to work for the weekend. And then next week is gonna be a lot better than this week was. Uh, more consistent, more upbeat a little bit more energetic we are not doing any objective mode solo i will i will not uh we're gonna absolutely hop into some some multiplayer stuff and see if we can get some objective mode stuff going on there um just because like it's kind of kind of sucks so we're gonna try and do uh objective mode on uh in multiplayer that way I can I can at least like enjoy myself a little bit more. It's a little bit less stressful. A little bit quicker, a little bit easier. A little bit of uh just more relaxing because the objective most stuff is just so not fun. Uh for the lower difficulty stuff as well, I'll probably end up doing like even just for like, you know, nuked normal or whatever, which I think I still have to do. Uh probably gonna end up doing uh Probably gonna end up doing like online for that as well, just to see if we can get it done. Um, I don't know how it's gonna work out. I might end up doing like a video where we do like multiple achievements just across like online and stuff, just to, to see if we can get some videos done that way, just to get some achievements knocked out, you know. But because uh, like the thing is, when you're playing online, you don't have total control over what game mode and, 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 and match and stuff you're playing, right? Some of those decisions are also made by the other people you're playing with and then you have to make sure that you actually can find people playing the game and it's just a, a lot that goes into uh, multiplayer that doesn't go into single mode or s a so single player, rather. Um, so, yeah. Oh. Check those stats out. Dude, how many of those things did we kill? I don't know. I don't pay attention to these numbers ever. I show them off because I know that uh, a couple of people like seeing them. I never care about it personally. I actually don't pay attention to it. Which is kind of funny. I look at like I stay on it. I'm like actually just straight up not paying attention at all. Um, yeah. Not at all. Even though it's there. I, I literally do not even look at a number. Lock and load. Not at all. And that's what I'm talking about. If I'm commentating it, I'm like, oh, we got like uh, 15 EDARs or something like that. Like, Yeah, I looked at it. 
because I saw it and I'm reading it and I'm talking about it. But like outside of that, which doesn't even happen often because again, I'm really not looking at it. I'm typically looking over at uh, Discord, seeing if anybody's chatting to me or whatever, if I have any notifications, any kind of uh, messages to read or whatever. Checking on the uh, the time of the video. I'm checking on uh, closing my eyes. <laughs> um, yeah, like uh, not really, not really, generally speaking, looking at those numbers. They don't really interest me. I don't really care how many things I killed. I care about like, okay, how many things that I killed, but I don't really care about how many clots I killed or how many of these I killed or how many of that I killed or whatever. Like it doesn't, uh, it's not, it's not interesting to me. I don't know why, but it just, uh, it just doesn't interest me. So I don't, I don't care about it personally, but I know that some people do. So I like to show it off because, you know, it's not like it hurts me to, to, to show it. I just, uh, yeah, I don't know. You, you, at the end of the episode, you can ask me, hey, how many uh, cloths did you kill? I literally could not tell you. you got out on I actually do not pay attention. At all. Which is, uh, I, I think it's kind of funny, because it's like sitting there for so long. And then I just, like, the entire time it's sitting there, just didn't notice any information on that screen. It just, like, doesn't register in my brain. Anyway, anywho's. I haven't been doing any kind of RuneScape. Again, I haven't played RuneScape at all in like a while. Since uh, the Tuesday stream, which I ended up cutting short, I have not played it at all. I haven't played it on my phone. I haven't played it on uh, my computer. I haven't played it like at all. Not at all. Not even a little bit. It has not been uh, played at all. Which is, uh, is a different experience for me this week. I normally do uh, my Reaper assignments at least every day. And I, just, I haven't even been doing those. I don't know why. Haven't uh, haven't wanted to. So I just say I'm not. I'm a. Uh... Okay. I'm not the kind of person who uh, likes games when they feel like responsibility. A lot of people will play a game. They'll be like, oh, I have to do this. I have to. I don't really wanna. But like you know, gotta get it done. Dailies. You know. I'm not. I'm not that kind of person. You know. I. Uh, for me. If I'm not having fun with the game. I'm not gonna play it. And that goes for the YouTube and the streams too, okay? I have ended streams early before. I have uh, ended videos early before. I have ended, you know, I haven't done any Amajack tries this week. Gunfire Reborn isn't going up. Uh, like, it's, you know, this is a great example of me just not really wanting to do it and then not doing it, you know? If I don't want to do it, I'm not going to do it. Um, which is to say that if you see me doing it, it's because I want to. You can rest easy knowing that uh, anything anything you see me doing on camera is, is definitely something that I, I want to be there doing. You know? Which is uh, something I can be I can be proud of saying, I think, kind of, a little bit. Um, because I think that a lot of people will push themselves to do something that they don't want to do. I don't do that. Um, you know, some things you have to do, like I have to pay bills. I have to... I don't want to pay bills, but like, you know, if I don't pay bills, I don't get to like... Live, really. So... You know, people always say that money can't buy you happiness, but it can pay your bills, and that's pretty like, you know, well well associated with happiness to me is when my bills are paid off. So, <laughs> money can't buy you happiness, but it can buy you a lot of things that are uh, definitely pretty uh, pretty pretty happy. You know. Just, uh, oh, people also, like, uh, I don't know. I was gonna go on a bit, but, like, I just watched a YouTuber, like, the other day that had the bit, and I'm like, I don't know if I really want to go on this bit, because it'll kind of feel samey to me. It makes me feel bad when I, uh, when I talk about something that I, I, uh, I recently watched somebody else talk about. Because I just feel like I'm copying them, like, I'm ripping them off, you know, and I'm just, to me, it's just, like, it's what, it's what's in my brain at the time, so I oftentimes do it, but... I, uh, I didn't want to do it today. Now you guys probably don't care. I'll have my own take on a on a matter, but like to me, it just kind of feels bad, right? Like I feel I don't feel original. I want to make sure that my ideas are my ideas. You know, it's not about uh, not copying, you know, Northern Lion or Zisto or Etho or whoever. It's about making sure that uh, I'm me. And I'm, I'm making the content that I'm making. It's my stuff. I did this. 
That's what matters to me. But, you know, sometimes sometimes it happens. Sometimes I want to talk about it. I'm like, you know what? Who cares? Um, so, you know what? Who cares? All right, let's do it. Okay? It's like the exact same bit, though. Like, I was thinking, like, where am I going to go with it, you know? And I'm like, I don't really think I have anything different to, to say about it. But anyway, Northern Line was talking in a video about how uh, people oftentimes, like, not understand how much, like, money costs. <laughs> um, they'll be like, hey, you know, use the cheaper Netflix option or whatever and, you know, save up and, and buy a house or whatever, you know. And it's like, well, you save, like, four bucks a month. It's gonna take you a long time before those four dollars kind of uh, turn into a house, right? It's it's really just not a lot of money. But a lot of people say like uh, to take all these small things and and uh, I guess I do have kind of a different take on the matter. So I'll, I'll I'll go on it. A lot of people will say to to take these small things and and save it up to buy a house. To a certain extent, you know, it's, it's you're kind of right. Wherein uh, four bucks is never really gonna add up to a house. It's just, it, the, the math just doesn't kind of work out that way, but at the same time, like, you got a lower tier Netflix subscription, you don't go out and buy your coffees at the store, you know, you don't, uh, you, you bring your phone plan down, you're, 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 you're adding up lots of, like, four or five dollars, whatever, now you're getting, like, thirty, forty, fifty dollars a month, right? And it's not much, but it's, it's, like, six hundred bucks a year that you're saving there. 600 bucks a year is not much. Still really not going to get you a house, but I mean, it can get you to a position where you can maybe make some investments into uh, your future. You know, you can you can maybe buy a car with it, right? Maybe maybe not a house, but you'll you'll be able to improve your life nonetheless by uh, by saving. And it's uh you know, you often find you oftentimes find people that uh, have a lot of money or the people who care more about uh, the small dollars, you know, like people who don't have a lot of money look at like okay, the you know, you go to ex you go to an extreme people who like I mean like the average you know you know typical person with with enough money to kind of like live and be fine in their life, right? Like not somebody who's like barely scraping by, but somebody who's like fairly comfortable, um, but just not uh, not wealthy. You know, you got bills to pay, and you're not able to go on vacations whenever you want, really. But like, you got a you got a comfortable life. You've got a computer, your phone, car, job. You know, all this all this stuff that that kind of makes you reasonably comfortable, but but not exceeding of anything. You know, for the average. Um, and uh, you, know, it's these people who are going to care about like a dollar, at least. I think if you go to. Uh, to, uh, to a store or something like that, it's like a dollar for a coffee or something like that. You're like, yeah, sure, it's only a dollar. Like, whatever. Whereas the people who have no money are like, dude, a dollar? You know how much food you can get for that? And the people who are rich are like, dude, a dollar? I didn't have that dollar before and now I do. You know? Or I... Whatever. But, like, the, the people who are really quite wealthy are going to care more about a dollar because they understand the value of it, I guess. And then the people who... Uh, have no money are going to understand the value of it as well. And then the people who have like an average life, I guess you kind of associate it more with time than uh, than a dollar value, right? Which I don't think there's anything right or wrong with it, but uh, people who live an average life, I, I guess that, that, that what happens is is you, know, you make like 15 bucks an hour and a dollar isn't really a dollar. It's it's just like a 15th of an hour. And you're like, whatever, I, I can just go get another dollar from work. Like, not a big deal, right? Whereas uh, saving all of those dollars and, and putting them into investments and stuff is oftentimes what, what helps you get to uh, to the next tier of, uh, of wealth. Oftentimes it's not, but it doesn't hurt, right? Anyway, that's uh, that's my take on it, I guess. That's going to do it for today. This is the final video I have to record today. I'm so tired and so glad to be done. Thanks for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.